Tim, who's continuing his Northern Territory adventure. G'day. G'day, Alex. If you can do me a favour and bump Langdon and Croucher next to you. They wanted Crocs here it. in the top end. We, we see are it. here to give it to you. Don't worry about that. Yeah, I know. There is Matt Wright. We are at his top end safari camp. Hey, check out these pictures yesterday. Mm. I decided to get really up close and personal because that's what Ali likes me to do. Um, and I got the chance here on the property to visit some of the rescue Crocs. Um, this is Chopper. Yeah, Chop <laughs> Chop. He enjoyed a little bit of goat yesterday. Okay. <laughs> and I got nice and close to him, gave him a little bit of an afternoon snack and thankfully stepped out of his enclosure, so um, I was not on the menu, thankfully. Uh, we're about to meet Tripod that is here, and Matt, yeah, sitting right in front of Tripod, um, that is a one-ton croc, salty, right there, five metres long. We will meet him and Matt in just a sec, but first a check of our forecast today. Good morning to you, Cairns, a top today of 32 degrees, 28 and partly cloudy for Brisbane, showers for Sydney and for Canberra, cloudy for Melbourne, Hobart and Adelaide, fine and sunny for Perth, 29, 33 for the Alice and Darwin, a shower or two around and a high today of 33 degrees. The one, the only, Matt Wright, the Outback Wrangler, joins us. Kenny. Oh, my God! Good morning. There you go, mate. <laughs> hey, so you've been out here enjoying yourself? Oh, I've just been having a little bit of fun. Yeah. yeah. This is this is dreams come true stuff, to be able to get up close and do this. I know this is your everyday office, but wowee, Matt, what an experience. There you go, boy. Oh, and a mate, little pat it, for good measure. Um, yeah, it is, it's Ooh. great. You can come out here, you can see some of these magnificent prehistoric... Ooh. Reptiles up close, up personal. Ooh. You know, it's um, this is tripod. He usually makes the debut on we're, TV. We're, we're very close to tripod here. I know he's only got three limbs. Can can he strike this far? Or has he got a gut full of food now, so he's happy. Timmy, like you said, he's a one-ton animal. He's only got three legs. All right, he can't move that fast, yeah. and he's got to come up uphill. If you're within a certain area in the danger area, yeah, you're you've yeah. got some problems. Fascinating to meet you. I, I've always wanted to have a chat to you about why you do this because people look at this and go, "They are dinosaurs." Yeah. What's the attraction, Matt? I think um, I think because of that, they're like a dragon, cross Tyrannosaurus Rex. <laughs> they're just they're just this they're massive apex they predator yeah, for people are. that are so fascinated with yeah. them. I think just apex predators in general, and being in the wild with them is, is pretty exciting. Now, this is one of your rescue crocs. You have a few on the property here that yeah. you can get people up close to, to learn a bit about, and, and really important that you went and got this one because Tripod was actually going for dogs and, and kids in a local community here. Yeah, so he was caught back in the mid 80s. I didn't catch him myself. Yep. It, was a, it was another um, croc catcher, Nick Robinson. He um, he actually caught this croc down the Daly River there. He was around a <sighs> community. He was eating the dogs. He was causing a lot of, lot of problems and yeah. potentially going to try and eat some one. So they had to get him out. He yep. went to a park yep. and he's in a breeding program there mm -hmm. and then retired. He's not much good anymore. No, well, Big old bull. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, this is retirement. Well, he's now. pretty happy here. He's very, very well looked after as are all those yeah. other rescue crocs. Um, and the education side of things that you get here when you come to the Top End Safari is supreme. There is uh, also a new series that is coming to nine screens very soon that we're going to tell you about in half an hour. For now though, Goodbye to you, Tripod. Tim, I'm happy Tim, to say goodbye to this if, one. If Tripod is one ton, yes, has Charles. three legs and is retired, you can get much closer than that. Way closer. Give him Charles a little scratch between his yeah. eyes. They well, here, I'll, give you, the I'll give you something to feed him, mate. Feed him, yeah. yeah. I don't think I can do this. Of course I you can. All you have to do is click a little bit got your thumbs thumbs on. Side feed of his Tripod live on air. This is earlier. awesome. No, come stay this side. Stay this side. I don't think I can do this. So what you have to do is just get it down this side. Tim, he's starting to move now. He's... No, no, come around here. That's come it. Just on, flick it. Him. You've got your flick safety it. thongs on, mate. Yep. You're fine. You've got your pluggers. Oh! Oh! <laughs> oh, my God. You've got a bit of salad with that. Oh. I should slow well, motor. Can I just say, there is no one I would... Uh, honestly, no one I would trust with doing this. Matt, you are the man. I am staying right by your side. Tripod's, Tripod's the man. Tripod's He's got more <laughs> power than both of us put together. <gasps> He's oh. always that way. He's OK. Oh, All right. Wow. Wow, how's the, wow. How's Thank the you, Matt. We'll see you in half an hour, Tim? guys. Bet you feel alive <sighs> right now. Bad daddy wear white pants. I'm oh, shaking. There's a little bit of weight. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Don't turn around. Yeah. Thank you, mate. No. It's pretty brave, Very brave. of Tim. It's good television.